Differences between ephemals and dolls. Ephemals versus dolls. Ephemals was proposed by Phillips and Hansen, 1990, which is a non-parametric approach used to dealing with serial correlation. Whereas dolls was proposed by Stock and Watson, 1993, and is an alternative, parametric, approach in which lags and leads are introduced to cope with the problem irrespectively of the order of integration and the existence or absence of co-integration. The abbreviation of FMLs is fully modified ordinary least square, whereas the abbreviation of dolls is dynamic ordinary least square. The objective of FMLs is to investigate the existence of a long-run relationship among variables. Whereas the objective of dolls is to investigate the existence of a long-run relationship among variables. The FMLs approach produces reliable estimates for small sample size and provides a check for robustness of the results. Whereas the t-statistic produces from dolls approximates the standard normal density better than the statistic generated from FMLs or OLS. Data type in both FMOLs and DOLLS approaches are panel data. Static command for both FMOLs and DOLLS approaches are given for testing purpose. FMOLs estimations are performed to confirm the consistency of the outcome, whereas DOLLS estimations are performed to confirm the consistency of the outcome. FMOLs estimator are all asymptotically normally distributed whereas dolls estimator are all asymptotically normally distributed. Procedure of FMOLs is that, if the tests reveal the existence of panel cointegration, I would use the panel FMOLs and panel dolls to examine the single cointegration vector and find out whether the independent variables have a positive or negative long-run relationship with dependent variable or not. At first, the panel FMLs model of Pedroni is used to correct both endogeneity bias and serial correlation problem in the panel data, Pedroni, 2000. This method is considered the most suitable technique to estimate long-run relationships when it comes to the existence of cointegrated panels. FMLs is helpful to address endogeneity and autocorrelation issues, Hansen and Phillips, 1990. Whereas when the existence of cointegrated panel are observed, then, the panel dolls model is applied for a robustness check. The panel dolls has some better sample properties than the panel FMLs, such as a less bias estimator in small sample size. Cow and Lu, 2000 concluded that DOLS performs better than OLS and FMLs in terms of unbiased estimation. DOLS is a simple approach to constructing an asymptotically efficient estimator that eliminates the feedback in the cointegrating system. Technically speaking, DOLS involves augmenting the cointegrating regression with lags and leads of so that the resulting cointegrating equation error term is orthogonal to the entire history of the stochastic regressor innovations. FMLs solve the problem of endogeneity and eliminate small sample bias. The application of the FMLs approach essentially requires that all variables must have the same order of integration and that the regresses must not appear as co-integrated. FMLs is the most suitable technique for the panel, which includes heterogeneous cointegration. The FMLs method was originally introduced and developed by Phillips and Hansen 1990 for estimating a single co-integrating relationship that has a combination of I1. The FMLs method has an advantage over the EG techniques in introducing appropriate correction to overcome the inference problem in EG method and hence, the t-test for long-run estimates are valid, Hamansu, 2007. The FMLs method utilizes kernel estimators of the nuisance parameters that affect the asymptotic distribution of the OLS estimator. In order to achieve asymptotic efficiency, 
This technique modifies least squares to account for serial correlation effects and test for the endogeneity in the regresses that result from the existence of county integrating relationships. Dolls solve the problem of endogeneity and eliminate small sample bias. The application of the FMLs approach essentially requires that all variables must have the same order of integration and that the regresses must not appear as co-integrated. Dolls technique solves the endogeneity problem and eliminates serial correlation present in standard ordinary least squares OLS. Dolls is a popular method for the estimation of equilibrium parameters in dynamic relationships between variables containing unit roots. Estimators of fMLs and dolls. OLS estimator is given for understanding the concept. After that, the fMLs estimator is constructed by making corrections for endogeneity and serial correlation to the OLS estimator. The dolls estimator is given for understanding the concept. After that, equation of dolls is given. The serial correlation and the endogeneity can also be corrected by using dolls estimator. The dolls is an extension of Stock and Watson's 1993 estimator. The dynamic OLS estimator is obtained from the equation of dolls given in end of slide. Example 1 of fMLs and dolls. In this example, you can see the results of coefficient and t-test are given for panel dolls and fMOLs regarding developing and developed countries for three variables. Example 2 of fMLs, dolls and CCR. In this example, you can see the results of coefficient, standard error, and adjusted R squared are statistically significant at 1% in three approaches. FMLs and dolls and CCR. It is important tip that is you can just change FMOLs in stata command by CCR. In order to get results of coefficients, standard error and adjusted R squared in conical co-integration regression. Kindly subscribe my YouTube channel Thesis Helper. Thanks for watching.